All right, my name is Ben Broderick. Here at camp, I'm known as Mr. Vinny. I first came to Pasquani in 1967. And I was a camper until 1969. Then was a counselor from 1971 until 1997 when I was asked to be director. This will be my 20th summer. A couple of years ago, where we had had, there was somebody, we didn't know who it was, somebody in camp was taking things. Nobody knew who it was. At all different levels, the campers had their own camp meeting. They talked about it in their camp meeting. The, we talked about it in, in our chapel service, which is geared really toward values, honesty, friendship, loyalty, that sort of thing, not, not really theological. We, we have circles in the dorms in which two nights a week, everybody gets around a lantern. We light by kerosene lamps because we don't have electric lights in the dorms. And they gather around the lantern and they talk of some topic that's important to them. And that's one of the topics that was discussed in those groups. So the stealing stopped. We never found out who it was. Those items were never returned. And at the end of the summer, the oldest boys, I was having a meeting with them about something else. And they said, you know, we'd really, we really hate to see this unresolved at the end. And we'd really like to just, we don't know if we'll do any good, but to do everything we can to see if we can fully resolve that. And I said, so what should we do? And they, and they suggested having one of them stand up in the dining hall, somebody who was not a camp officer, had no official position. And I said, so who should that be? And they suggested Jafar Sharipov, who is from Uzbekistan, had come here never having been to the United States before. Russian was his first language. He basically learned his English here. And they said, but everybody respects him. And, and so Jafar stood up with a week to go and, and spoke about why this is important to resolve it. We never got fully resolved, but their concern, their investment in a community of honesty and trust was so strong that they felt uncomfortable without having it totally resolved. Uh, and also they know each other so well that they knew who the right person would be to do this.